The middle school xylophone excerpt for Allstate is the Allegro from Sonata Number no. 3 from the book Masterworks for Mallets. And you're going to play the pickup note or the eighth note before C to the end. Um, most of this is in F. It's a good idea to practice in F major scale. Just to remind yourself that that B flat is always in the key signature. At one point, though, you do go into a minor mode. Notice that in measure 35, there's an A flat on the end of one. So that means all the A flats for the rest of the measure are going to be flat. So don't forget that. Um, technically, I think one thing that you want to do is leading into measure 37, play the two sixteenth notes before 37, starting with your left hand, so that you finish on the lowest note with your left. And don't play an E flat, it's an E natural. The rolls that happen on the and of three in measure 37, and again in 38, and again in 39, I think it's best if you think about playing four quick notes with those. Each time I start with my right hand. So I'm doing this, but just much quicker. The other one in measure 39 goes from an E to an F. So I would practice that several times. Four quick notes for those eighth note rolls. I would also incidentally try to use a softer mallet. These are some rubber mallets. Use some rubber mallets or some yarn covered mallets that you can still hear every single note. But it's not going to sound as harsh. It'll sound nicer on this, this excerpt. Uh, in measure 40, when you get to the 16th notes at the end of the measure, make sure you start those with your right hand so that your left hand stays on the bottom. And then it's nice to do, I think, on the last line, a little bit of uh, a retard. Even though it says second time to do the retard, go ahead and do it on this because you're not going to play it for two times. Okay, so here is the Allegro from Sonata number no. three in its entirety.